Hi! Welcome back to the English class with Miss Amy. In this video, we are going to talk about comparative and superlative adjective. But before that, we will leave you about adjective. Adjective is a word that gives more information about a noun. For example, big book. Big is an adjective and book is a noun. Small house, heavy bag, clever kid. Usually, an adjective is in front of the noun. Now it's about syllable. On the second grade, we already learned about syllable. Syllable is a unit of organization for a sequence of speech sound. How to count syllable? It's very easy. Say the word and clap your hand. For example, heavy, heavy. The number of the claps is the number of the syllables. Heavy, two syllables. Hot. One syllable. Clever. Two syllables. Next, what about beautiful? Say the word beautiful and clap your hand. Beautiful. Three syllables. It's so easy to count syllable. Now, comparative adjective. When we compare two things or people, we use comparative adjective. When we compare using short word, one or two syllable, we just add ER at the end of the adjective. Let's see the example. Here, I have two pencils, red pencil and orange pencil. We are going to talk about the length of this pencil, so we will use the word long. Now, you say the word and clap your hand. Good job! Long, so long has one syllable. We just add er at the end of the adjective, so it will be longer. The sentence, the red pencil is longer than the orange pencil. Now let's see the second example. I have a car and a bike. We will use the word heavy. Say the word, clap your hand. Good job, heavy. Two syllables. We also add ER for adjective that has two syllables. And the sentence will be, A car is heavier than a bike. Remember, if an adjective ends in one vowel and consonant, we double the consonant and add ER. For example, big. And then double the G and become bigger hot, hotter, and so on. And if an adjective ends with Y, we change the Y into I, and then add ER. Happy, happier. The Y changes into I. Easy, easier, and so on. When we compare using long words, an adjective that has three or more syllables, we add more adjective than. For example, the word interesting. Say the word and clap your hand. Interesting. So the word interesting has four syllables. Look at the example. We have playing with friends and watching movie. The sentence will be playing with friends is more interesting than watching movie. Second example, we have dangerous. Say the word, clap your hand. Good job. Dangerous has three syllables. We have a picture of crab and scorpion. And the sentence will be, scorpion is more dangerous than a crab. Now about superlative adjective. We use superlative adjective when we want to compare Three or more things. When we compare using short word, one or two syllable, you just add the and then the adjective and then est at the end of the adjective. Look at the example. Here I have three pencils. The blue pencil, the red pencil, and the orange pencil. We are going to talk about the length of these pencils. 
You can see that the blue pencil is the longest pencil. So we will use the word long. Long. One syllable. Short word. Okay. So the sentence will be, The blue pencil is the longest of all. Long and then plus EST. Good. Now move to the second example. I have three houses. Anna's house. Jack's house and Jane's house. We will use the word big. Big. One syllable. Short word. Just add EST. And the sentence will be Anna's house is the biggest of all. When we compare three things or people using long words, an adjective that has three or more syllables, we add the plus most plus adjective and now look at the example I have three activities playing with friends watching movie and flying a kite and we will use the word interesting as we know that the word interesting have four syllables so the sentence will be flying a kite is the most interesting activity for me and the second example I have three small animals a scorpion crab and caterpillar we will use the word dangerous say dangerous and clap your hand good job dangerous has three syllables so the sentence will be scorpion is the most dangerous of all and these are the tables to sum up our lesson today on comparative and superlative adjective i'll see you on the next session bye